Hello everyone, in today's presentation, I will speak about skills that we have to improve once we graduate as digital marketing master degree. As you can see here, we have skills to be improved for future careers. The skills that I'm going to talk about here in this presentation that we have to improve, you know, we all know that after graduation we're going to feel happy and, you know, to find a job and seeking careers. But, just in case, if you're going to study any of the skills that I'm going to talk about that we need to qualify, if you're going to study it in this course, I can guarantee nobody's going to pass. It's totally, totally, totally difficult to learn. But uh, we, we can learn them in a way or two. Well, missed qualification uh, from first company uh, requirement, as, a, as you can see. Well, we have this company, it's called Ashton Gate. They are missing qualifications that I really personally I need to improve and you know I'm very well known as a hater of computer programming. The first one that we have here is SSO. From the, from the name of it you can know how terrible it is. It's single sign-on which means is an identification method that enables a website user to log in in multiple applications with one set of credentials. It's terrible. Literally terrible, but uh, learning this one, single sign use, it makes you logged in completely in such different types of websites. There is a method on how to deal with it. It's very, uh, uh, it's very required and needed in, in many companies. We have HTML5, a markup language used for structuring and presenting content on the World Wide Web. When we talk about HTML, or HTML5 in general, we're talking about the mystical dimension of the internet. There is no website without uh, HTML. There is nothing you can do without HTML. Working with an HTML, it needs a type of uh, proficiency because one mistake can destroy a whole website. A single mistake, just like a plus or one letter can destroy the whole website. So this one is very needed. I don't know why many companies, not many companies, 5% of companies started requiring um, uh, marketing and CRM executive to be qualified with computer programming uh, skills. Not, not many companies, but some of them. So this is one of the uh, skills that must be improved. The other one is CSS. Uh, this one is uh, cascading style sheets. Well, this one is CS, uh, CSS as a computer language for laying out and structuring web pages such as HTML or XML. Almost the same as HTML5, uh, uh, but with different procedures, uh, with different uh, technical, uh, you know, part. We have missed qualification from the second company requirements. This company is called Fair Share. Uh, the missed qualification here is proof reading. You have to really look at these uh, missed skills because honestly, sometimes you can find something that you don't understand that you need to make a research, uh, to do research. This one is uh, proof reading. Proof reading is... Oh yeah, sure. Uh, check a final draft carefully and correcting uh, typos, grammatical mistakes and other writing issues before public publications. Well, in, in that part you need to correct other people's uh, mistakes when they write grammatically and this one you have to improve. Well, uh, from the other side, uh, there's a contradiction here. Well, I'm not qualified to be a proofreader, but at the end of the story here I have written uh, two books with 150,000 to 200,000 words. Those are the books, but still, I'm not qualified. So how did I write them? And how did I com com how, how I completed them? Thanks for the publish house. After me, they corrected the grammatical mistakes that I have made. So there's a third party in here who in was involved in this. Well, we can see skills to be learned. The first one is single sign-on, HTML5, cascading style sheets, and proof reading. Thank you so much, everyone, and stay away from computer programming if you don't want to lose your mind. <laughs> Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you so much. Thank you. Wake up. Today's going to be a good day. Wake up. Today's going to be a good day. Wake up. Today's going to be a good day.